What up, what up? So this is my guy now. My guy. My guy. What's this? What is that? What is that? Hey, started this show me. Okay. Two percent XP boost. Well, let's go do something quick. We chop down some trees. Quick, quick. Get to chopping, boy. What's my chopping at? My chopping's at six. I need to become a professional chopper. Choppers in the building. Chopper, choppers in the building. I should probably just go buy him a, an iron hatchet at least. Help the man out a little bit. He's having a hard time. I mean, he is fucking hacking away. It hasn't even made a mark. Oh, it's gone. Swing away. Smack, 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 smack. Fuck that tree up. Both sides. Oh, shit. 2% XP boost. I got like four additional XP out of that. What is this thing? Let's do this again. Uh... Win multiple unlocks for a chance to in get increased amounts of prizes when opening rainbow treasure chest. Okay. Yay. Unlock all multipliers and win up to seven times prizes. Whatever that means. Continue? Okay. Fuck that chest. Fuck this chest up. What? That's not the chest I clicked on. What'd you give me? Unlocks the next multiplier during Rainbow's End for increased amount of prizes. Uh, you know, I don't like the symbolization that's going on here, so convert. Yeah. What's that? What's that? What's this one? Um, are these, wait. Isn't this the same shit as the last one? I converted to a hundred of those rocks, bolts. Please, tell me why I would care about this. What is this for? The fuck is this? I haven't accepted any of these. I don't know if I should be. But I got these things. They seem more resourceful. This star can be drained of energy to give you bonus XP. Wow. Convert. What is this? They want me to actually buy something with real money? No. Oh, thanks. How exciting. Nothing happened. I got bolts now. Get out of my face. What's this for anyway? What is this? Jesus. Stop trying to sell me things. What's this? Categories? Ranged. What is that? I don't know what I'm doing. Why 
What the fuck? They want me to f fucking pick a quest, huh? A shadow over a head. That's not here. Are you asking me to do a member's quest, you fucking piece of shit? There's members quest that I can do. Why are you suggesting I do a quest that I can't actually do? Challenges. Let's do this. Sounds like shit. Don't feel like doing that. Can I even do pickpocketing? Member skill. Get the fuck out of my face. Hey, what's good, man? Man, streaming. Yeah, explains why you censored yourself. <laughs> uh, let me put these in my. What am I doing with these? So, how far behind am I now? I don't know. A lot. <laughs> what is this? Metal dragon trinkets. Why would I want to buy multiple of these? What are they for? What is an ottoman? I'm going to buy this. Don't know what it is, but I'm going to buy it. I'm going to buy a lamp. Can I do something with this? It's going to give me XP. Rub. Oh, yes. Oh, that, that's wonderful. Okay, let's use all these on that. For now on, that's what this is for. Yes. Yes! Feed me. Yo, if you get those little nuts and bolts thingies, if you, like, you get that event that gives you those little, like, I don't know, it looks like you I get the... what you're talking about. Yeah. Some of my dash. How many do you have? I don't know, like 200, I think. Oh, wait, no, I think I have 60 or 80 or something. What? It's either 60, 80, or 200. All right, well, when you get, like, 125, or I just got, like, over 300, okay, almost no, 400 from no, one. I have, like, I don't have that much then. I think I have 60, because I remember looking at it. Yeah, Something well, like when you do those events, always convert into that shit, and then get that shit, and then buy those, buy, like, when you, when it's in your inventory, click on it, and it'll open up a store, and then buy the lamps that are there, and it just gave me, like, shit tons of experience. It doesn't even tell you how much experience it's gonna give you, it just gave me a lot. Is that so? Yes. Right, well, I'm heading to one the it's got like almost 2,000 experience from two of those. In an instant. That's great. The odd oddments? Okay, yeah, the little... little. You got 60 of them? Yeah. Yeah, well, um... What is it that even... That I triggered that with? Uh, oh, that... That chest thing that pops up on the top right of your screen, it's like a, uh, 
Like an event or something? Yeah, the thing with the keys. Yeah, click on that. I already did that. That's how I got those random things yesterday. Yeah, don't ever uh, always convert whatever your prize is into uh, those nuts and bolt thingies, and then buy those uh, XP lamps because that's that's great. Anytime you can get a boost in XP in this game is like saving you time pretty much. Oh. Uh, I don't think I'm going to be doing that with this prize. It's a multiplier unlock. For the next uh, roll. Eh, uh, fuck it. Oh, so I should have done that with all of my, uh, those clothing things then. Would you buy, like, some cosmetics or some shit from it? No, um, remember that mass or Silverhawk boots? I'm pretty sure the Silverhawk boots came from that prize, and I didn't convert them. Oh. Wait, can you still? Because I think I might have a pair. I don't think I can. It's in my bank. But the prismatic lamp is the one that you're saying I should buy? Yeah. I have enough for one of them. Oh, like, you, oh, um, by the way, you know how, like, when you're a pack, around a pack of enemies that is, uh, stronger than you, they'll automatically go aggro on you? Um, if they're weaker than you, they won't, by the way. If they're, like, a lower level than you, they won't attack you. Um, but, uh, if you're standing around them for a while... For, I think it's like 15 minutes. If you're standing around them for like 15 minutes, they'll stop going aggro on you. That's how you can survive in tough dungeons. You just kind of got to play it safe for like 15 minutes and then you can start kind of being a little bit more careless. But if you switch areas, they'll go aggro on you again. Are you listening to me at all or no? Yeah, um, I'm okay. looking for where I'm going to put the XP for this into. I'm probably going to do defense. For better armor. What's your defense at? 10. My attack yeah, is 13. Definitely want my better. strength is 12. I'd like to have something. I I'd like to get it up so I can get black. Yeah, See mine. Levels. It pretty much caught me up with the rest of them. Mine, I can just hard focus on range, and then I don't have to focus on any other stat really. I probably should be working. Why? Well, I, I naturally work on my defense with my range as well, for some Maybe reason. Five ottomans left over. So what do you get a key every day or some shit? I got four of them today and four of them yesterday, but I wasted all my uh, my nuts and bolts yesterday on some stupid shit. In that stupid store. I should have bought lamps. I would have had like... I probably would have been an extra level up by now. Oh, I found where all of my... Uh, I found a place where I could view my statistics for everything. Yeah. Where is I that? I have a plus 30 against ranged and negative 26 against magic. My total armor is 293 and my damage is 146 with an accuracy. Is that under one equipment and then you hit the stats button? Well, the way I summary? found it is I went to my bank and it was like show worn equipment panel and I hit that and then that showed up. Okay. Yeah, you should get like, there's like four tabs there. Achievements, loadout, skills, and summary. Yeah, I found the, the first one opened up the same summary. thing I was looking yeah. at. Where it shows my backpack, one equipment, and all my stats. What's your total level? We need to work you on my some... Uh... Level, I'm only 15. My total level is 82. Alright, yeah. we need I'm to get you 15. working on some like skills. Like uh, yeah. woodcutting or something like that. 
I mean, you're actually pretty rich right now, so you really don't need to do much. And you can actually um, choose pretty much any skill that you want to do because you have so much money and uh, power level it because you can buy shit tons of the materials that you need to uh, power level that skill. Like if you want to do smithing, you can buy shit tons of bronze bars or iron bars. or You don't want to buy a lot of bronze at first because you are going to level up fast, but you buy shit tons of like hundreds of bronze bars, level up to iron bars, buy thousands of those, and then uh, do all those iron bars, and then you just keep going and keep going until you can, you'll be able to afford it easily. Figure if it's like 350 a bar, and you buy a thousand of them, it's 350,000. Sounds like a lot, but that's how much you'd want to invest into it, pretty much. A lot of these. Eventually, you start making uh, money back on them. I just realized a lot of these are member skills. A lot of them are, yes. That's gay. Yeah. This game is definitely. This game, even more so than Old School RuneScape, is definitely geared towards uh, members. <clears throat> I'm probably just going to focus on smithing then. I feel like that would more so match my type of character. Well, I guess uh, trying to find a skill that you can do a lot with on um, on free to play, and then once you feel like you want to buy membership, you can buy membership and continue doing that skill, and then start doing members things with that skill, like building better material. So yeah, smithing would actually be really good because you can build probably all the way up to rune now. And then, I think I can go up to 59 before I need members. Yeah, that's that's probably the the uh, best skill for you then. I'm going to try to get the members as soon as the beginning of the month starts. Oh, you, and you can easily get to uh, 59 in a couple days if you uh, focused on it. It's... I'm not going to be spending my whole day. Oh, on oh. This. I am not ever going to spend my whole day playing this game. Well, a lot of people do it. But anyway... Um, yeah, I'm not, not going to be a hardcore. You can player. you can uh, train your uh, mage at the same time as you train your smithing by doing um, my mage. Yeah, and I know you're not a mage, but being having mage abilities is very helpful. Even if you're not a mage, some mage abilities are really good. Um, I don't know if they. Yeah. How possible would it be for me to be a battle mage? Uh. Probably pretty, yeah, it's possible. You could easily, you want to, it would be good for you actually because you could swap between being a mage and being a uh, a warrior, you know, or you. Can a mage cast spells? Okay, so. You don't want to, so this is the thing. Your, uh, your op, the twos are, two are opposite of each other. It's better for you to be like a ranged mage kind of deal or a ranged warrior, but ra mage and a warrior are opposites of each other. If you're wearing uh, warrior armor, you won't do any damage at all. You have to be wearing your mage gear in order to do, do damage with magic spells. I'm not going to worry about that then. But it's good for other reasons. I got to see what uh, they have on this uh, on this game as compared to old school RuneScape. But you used to be able to uh, insta-teleport and shit. Like if you're fighting somebody out in the wild, you can just fucking instantly teleport away and they can't hurt you. But I would need... So, I could still do that with my warrior stuff, right? No. That's a major... Yeah, see, I'm not, I'm not going to worry about that then. If that's I would a major... switch my whole armor set... Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You could do that with your warrior stuff on. Yeah, yeah, Sorry. That's what I'm... I was saying combat... Combat... Like, combat stuff with a mage won't work. But there's other passive abilities and stuff that are really good. That um, I'm probably going to get mage for that same reason. And you should always be as versatile as you can in this game. There's no, like, there's no, it's not going to make you weaker to focus on another skill. It would just take more time. It's not like playing Elder Scrolls. <laughs> no. There's, I mean, you can, you can max out everything. You can be the best mage, the best range, and the best warrior all at the same fucking time. <laughs> There's uh people online you can watch fucking uh, like some of the best RuneScape players. They're nuts.
They're probably like fat, sweaty, and live in their grandparents' basement. Oh, that's fun. That's your typical RuneScape player. Yeah, that's not me. <laughs> no, you live in your grandparents' attic. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, split blonde and robe. See, that's good. Is it possible to get another uh, an extended bag? Because I see next to my shield icon, there's a bag icon. Uh, I don't think so. What? It's your shield icon. Where? Yeah. On uh, my equipment page, next to my shield, there's a pouch looking thing. Uh, no, that's a, uh, a st oh, what is that? Yeah, above my, so for me, I think it's like above my head. Either way, it looks like a pouch. Yeah. Uh, that's a, uh, I had one, I think. Somebody gave it to me. It's a, uh, rune... Runite ore pouch it's to hold certain types of materials. I think. You're better off Googling it, though. I don't fucking know. But I know it's not like an extension of your inventory. You wouldn't be able to hold basic stuff that you pick up off the ground in there. I know that for a fact. <clears throat> but there's a skill called summoning. And uh, with summoning, you can have a follower like a pet or something and um they can carry stuff for you that they're like an extension of yourself so they're good too and they can bring stuff back and forth from the bank which is awesome i don't know if you're listening to me anymore or if i'm just talking but either way yes yes i'm just talking no comment You're a horrible friend. I'm not your friend. <laughs> Alright, so you were talking about pouches, so I went into the Grand Exchange, and there was one for like 600, which now I'm assuming it's a one-use thing, but it's a summon spirit wolf pouch, and it summons a combat familiar. Oh, really? Yeah, I can't equip it in that slot. It's probably a member's item. Well, I just summoned it, and now I have a, a, a spirit wolf following me. For real? I interact with him, and he says wolf. Don't don't lie to me, you stupid bitch. I examine him, and it says man's significantly less domestic or man's significantly less domesticated friend. Bro, uh, I'm fucking. This just this made my day. The fact that RuneScape has a wolf that follows me. Where, where are you? At? Oh, you can get dragons and shit to follow you. All types of shit. Well, yeah, but this is a wolf. I fuck with wolves, man. It's my favorite animal. I'm oh, I'm uh killing hill giants. Remember where we were? Uh, like. Did I take you here? I think I did. I know no, I did. No, you never did. You never took me anywhere as hill giants. All right, well, let me finish killing this guy, and then I'm gonna come up to you. But I'm pretty sure that this wolf helps me attack. Are we in the same world? That's, that's what it says. It's, I joined your world, yes. Okay, so um, I'm at the Grand Exchange. Okay, so I'm gonna tell you where to go. Okay, it's very simple, actually. If you, okay. Dragonstone armor. It's all. It's a. It's all type. I'm assuming I need level fifty and everything to use that, or armor. What? Level fifty and armor, and I can get dragonstone groups and shit. I'm just looking at like some of the stuff that was under the name dragon. Oh yeah, they have dragon armor, and that's, uh, that's, like, pretty much what you want to aspire to be able to use when you get to level 60. Okay, so I just walked out the Grand Exchange. 
Okay, so um, go. You want to go southwest, like more west than south. Like, there's a building there. It's like a, a cook's hut or some shit. Should have a symbol for like a quest there. You want to go above that. You don't want to go below it. You want to go. Do I want to go on, on over the bridge? No. It's before the bridge. It's so if you're by the bridge, go north. So the hut, the hut that's north yes. Of it. Yeah, yeah, go down the that. stairs. Oh, right. You can't oh, go. To... It appears that it appears this wolf only stays with me for a certain amount of time. Did you go? Oh, did... That door's locked. My dear. yeah, my bad. I forgot. Uh, you're gonna need a brass key. I'm coming. Is it possible for you to open it for me? No. Fuck. So I need to go all the way back and grab a key. Yeah. Buy what's called literally just a brass key. Does it get consumed every time I go through the door? No. You hold it in your inventory. So that and a bunch of food is really all you should bring. Yeah, so this wolf isn't going to stay with me. It has it only is with me for like five minutes. So then only use it before you go into battle. If you buy it next time. What is it called anyway? I want to buy one. What is this? Somebody has a tab of ashes here. It's called a spirit. Uh, Did you get one? I have to raise the gold price for it because it was a uh, no bueno. Yeah, I had to raise it to like 10,000, but then I bought it for like 2,500. Oh, by the way, when you're looking at all your sales, you can just hit claim all. So you don't have to go into each yeah, individual I tab. I know how to collect all. I figured that out day one. Shut the fuck up. You shut the fuck shut up. Shut the fuck don't up. Know as much as I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I don't. I don't know right, anything you know about what? this game. I'm just withdrawing all my coins, and I will buy it with all my money. <laughs> <laughs> don't put all your money up there. Don't do that. Don't ever, because if someone's selling it for five million, you'll buy it for five million. <laughs> oh, it goes for the cheapest one. If, yeah, but I mean, if it's not selling, if someone like just don't do that. It's a bad mistake. I've done that before and accidentally bought shit for like five times the price I should have paid for it. Just put ten thousand. You'll definitely get it. Okay. Yeah, I already I have it. Also, look, that's my wolf. He's going away in one second. What was it called again? Spirit Wolf Pouch. Is there more animals? Uh, I don't know. No, I looked up pouch, and that was the only thing that showed up. How many did you buy? Right now I only have one on me. Oh. Oh, I remember this area. You took me here on the old school RuneScape. Yeah, it's a very popular area, for sure. Um, I'm assuming you went into a corner and just sat there and shot at him? Yep. Is it possible to have a... I, I guess it really doesn't matter. I was going to say it's possible to have more than one character, but it really don't matter. Yeah. Because you could just make your character everything. Um, sometimes it's... <laughs> some people will, like, 
have a character and just keep it at level one and do what I was doing my first day and just pretend that you're a noob and get people to donate shit tons of money to you and then just transfer it over to another main account. Hey, man. Let's go, nigga. Oh, shit. I already fucked up. <laughs> so I should follow you? Yeah. Ow. They heard it at me. Did you bring a lot of food? Yeah. Even hurting him. Uh, is he even is he? Am, am I even like phasing him? <laughs> there, you did a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, when they drop limp roots, uh, might as well just pick them all up because they're worth like, I think like two k each, maybe a little bit less. Twelve k, right now. Wait, what? Or tw twelve 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 hundred. Oh, so for this familiar stuff, I have to go to an obelisk. Um, I don't like how many of them are showing up. Only like two, two of one out of every five attacks are going through. The rest is he's just like you can't touch me. <laughs> he's just blocked. So you need to get your attack up. So getting my attack up causes me to have higher hit chance. Yeah, like higher hit accuracy. Because that's my biggest issue right now. I think it's only slightly though. Actually, it might be strength. Honestly, I don't know. But I think strength just governs how high you hit when you do hit. Are they like lining up to fight me? <laughs> I'm fighting the one behind them. Oh, okay. I'm guessing you're inside of me. Yeah. Plans why I don't see you. Taking me so long to kill this mofo.
how kind. This wizard man next to me is also hitting my guy during with an AoE attack. Stupid spirit wolf. You're not even helping me. All you're doing is teleporting around. I mean, that's cool and all, but it's not funny. <laughs> oh, great. Another three year long battle with this giant. I'm like almost out of food just from fighting two fucking giants. Really? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we gotta find somewhere weaker for you. Uh, yeah, best place is gonna be for you is we're just gonna have to go fight cows. <laughs> It'll be great because I'm gonna fucking murder all the cows. <laughs> I'm gonna stand in one spot and just murder all the cows around me. Okay, so when you're done fighting that, uh, teleport to Lumbridge. Copy. I have one piece of lobster left. <laughs> All right, teleport to Lumbridge. Wait, oh uh, yeah. Who the fuck did I just run off to? I was wondering why you ran off, but. Yeah, I don't know either. I was like, yeah, I maybe oh, he knows I what he's I might doing. I clicked the map by mistake. Alright, well, I'm going to Lumbridge. I'm assuming you're gonna meet me there? Yeah. Yeah, you know what? I should definitely become a mage. Because I can make myself enchanted, uh, enchanted uh, arrows and shit. I'll probably have to give you some food, but it'll be alright. To fight cows? They will do some damage over time. Cows are gonna whoop my ass. Meow, meow, motherfucker. Wouldn't it be better to fight the goblins? No, the cows are better. They have more HP. So they take a little bit longer to kill. M more XP. Oh yeah, this is going to be bad for the cows. It's a fucking cow genocide now. I'm just one hitting all of them. Is any of this stuff worth picking up from the cows like the beef? Um, um well, you can make food out of the beef if you need it come the time. Uh and the cow hide is actually worth a pretty good amount of money. Uh but you have 5 million so it's really not worth much to you. 
it's not really worth your time to be honest. If you were struggling for money, I would say definitely. But dude, I'm like one hitting these cows. Yeah, they're like a, it's like one step up from those men that we were fighting. What's the next step up from this? Uh, hill giants. You want to basically be here until you can fight the hill giants. I know it doesn't seem like much now, but this is a lot of XP over time. You can kill them so quickly. We're just helping them slaughter cows is all. There's no cows in this area because of me. <laughs> I took out a good bit too. But I don't think you're throwing them. Yeah, I, I don't even have to go anywhere. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna hit a cow with a special attack. <laughs> You didn't take it well. I'm about to backhand the shit out of a cow. <laughs> he just ran up to that cow and was like, bitch. Move for me. So what's prayer for? Prayer? Um, it's more kind of like passive magic that gives you, uh, it'll give you buffs and shit. That makes sense. And, um, like if you, you can open up your prayer, your prayer tab. It's a little like star and then, uh, click on that. And it'll show you the prayer abilities that you will be able to unlock and the ones that you already have unlocked. Um, if you click on it, it drains your prayer resource and you can only refuel it by praying at an altar. So you really only want to do it when you're like in a battle with something that you really need it for. Otherwise, then it just drains and then you don't have any. Uh, if you happen to pick up any of my uh, anything, feel free to give it to me because I dropped a lot of shit. I'm my shit. my knives and my uh, darts. Yeah, I haven't picked up any. I'm not running around collecting your garbage. Shut the fuck up. You're just mad because I showed that cow who the real fucking backhander was. I am actually very mad about that. What? What you just said. That I can backhand cows? Yeah, I'm mad about that. I don't know why, you but... can't? Yeah. Hmm. I well, mean... That answers why, you dumb fuck. Yeah, all I can do is throw knives at him. I have darts in my main hand, and my off hand is knives. I'm using my ultimate on this motherfucker. Boom. This person's just watching me slaughter her cows. <laughs> what up, Mr. Moo? Fuck off. It's my cow. Get your room. I already leveled up my range. No.
I'm just running through the farm, killing all the fucking cows. <laughs> I'm losing so much money in darts and arrow and knives because I'm not like my they're not collecting up in a stack so they're just all over the place and I don't feel like picking them all up. Usually if I'm that expensive. Yeah. I paid hundreds of thousands for these. Oh, boo -hoo. <clears throat> Have you even gotten hurt by a cow yet? Uh, one touched me, but it didn't hurt me. <laughs> so, how, uh... How's the cooking tree? Yo, that... That Battlefield 4 clip, bro. That shit was dirty. That was seven people in a row. I was just blop, blop. Lot one after the other. It was I. I was pretty proud of myself. A couple headshots. Are you smoking on stream? A cigarette. Yeah, it's still smoking on stream. Do they frown upon that too? Smoking uh, cigarettes? I, I hope not. They might. They honestly might. I don't know. It's because I've been sm I ain't gonna stop smoking cigarettes on stream. I can't not play smoke cigarettes while I play video games. <laughs> Just a fucking attic. Can't yeah, well, you're a basement. What? Well, I'm in the attic. No, you're not an attic. I, you're. I, I you said I'm an attic. You're a basement. I, know, I, get, I get what you're saying, but you're completely wrong because I'm also an attic. Should I just sit here for and the, train these and for the life of me? Stuff high enough for black. Yeah, you want to. You honestly, even though they're like really weak, you want to train here for a while. Especially because we're non-members, there's not that much we can really go do at this level yet. You know what? You should just go play Wizard One Hundred One. Wizard One Hundred One could suck a dick. I got an email the other day on one of my old emails that I used to play Wizard 101 on when I was like 10. And it was like Wizard 101's getting a spring update and I was like, yo, word, about to get back into it. <laughs> like, that used to be my shit when I was younger. That's all I ever played was- I played Wizard 101 like you played RuneScape. No, I never played any game like I played RuneScape, unfortunately. I took my life and I was like, I don't need this shit. And you know what's crazy? As much as I played RuneScape, I never even got an ability to 99. Other people on here have multiple 99 abilities. And that's like, it takes so much time. I could never bring myself to just sitting there for weeks hacking away at a fucking tree. <laughs> that's why every day it's a new ability. You just focus all your abilities a day, like se get seven abilities, and every day of the week focus all day on one ability. Yeah, I've been doing. I I always do something different every day. Yesterday was begging for money. <laughs> <laughs> the day before that, also begging a different area for money. <laughs> <laughs> no, actually, same areas and same world, same words, everything. <laughs> no, I had to come up with a new script because uh, I couldn't tell people I just came out of Tutorial Island anymore. <laughs> <laughs> so now what were you telling them? Um I was like <laughs> I was asking people, do I have I was like, am I doing good? Is this good equipment? I really don't know. I'm new at this game. Can somebody help me? And somebody just gave me a bunch of equipment and money. <laughs> you just gotta act like a noob, dude, I'm telling you. They love it. I mean, I am a noob, so it's kind of right. I'm not completely lying. <laughs> You're knowledged greatly. You're just not knowledged in the aspects of three. Yeah. I know a lot RuneScape about RuneScape. Did you ever play two? 
Uh, yeah. That was like, um, before RuneScape 3 came out, RuneScape, old, old school RuneScape became this, and then they, like, it's so weird, I don't actually know how they did it, because that was like a time period when I stopped playing, but, um, old school RuneScape kept evolving and evolving and evolving, and people didn't like it, so they wanted to keep it the way it was, and then also create what they wanted to aspire RuneScape to be, at some point, they split off into two games. I get it, like, why they would want to continue, uh, you know, making it better and better, because this is actually pretty good, but I still love old school RuneScape. You only love it because of the nostalgia. No, it's actually great. It's actually a great fucking game. I just can't fucks with it because of how dated it is. That's probably why they made this so similar to it, just newer. Right. It's pretty much, yeah, it's pretty much the same game. It's the same everything except for... You know, a couple of areas and yeah, here and there, abilities. And there. It's definitely updated in terms of graphics. It was in. They said in 2012, what they did was uh, added evolutionary fighting. Actually, the fighting in this is actually pretty cool. The way you can only use certain abilities until your adrenaline gets up, and then you can use threshold abilities, and then your ultimate ability. That's pretty cool. There's, I don't think I've ever played a game like that. It allows you to become uh, wow. more interactive in your. Well, it's like it allows you to be more interactive in your fights. Actually, they took that from WoW and Diablo. Oh, well, Blizzard yeah. Blizzard is the one who originally started stuff like that. Figures Blizzard is the best. Blizzard's number Blizzard. one. Blizzard's a really good company. They made some great games. Yeah. Very few, but very popular in terms of games. I wouldn't say few. It most games, I would say most most game companies focus on like one or two series. They did a lot. True. Sure. Some of their things were copies, though. Like Hero of the Storm and Hearts, Hearthstone and Heroes of the Storm were copies of other games, which were pretty disappointing. Yeah, they just made their own flavor of it, though. They, it's like that era where everybody is making a type of genre, and you have to jump on it. Yeah, but WoW was like. The, oh, the MMO that really took off, the MMORPG that took off and made MMORPGs a thing. Yeah, this was the only game that was, like, breathing down its neck was RuneScape. And, like, people always, like, just wrote it off like RuneScape was completely shit because it was, for one, it had a free-to-play option. And I think that made it worse in the people's eyes because they're like, oh, if you, you don't have to pay a lot of money for it. It sucks. There's so much more you can do in this game than any other game, I think, in the world. Like, as far as each ability, and so much you can do, so many quests, everything for each individual ability. And then it would take you a year <laughs> for, like, any ability to get it to 99. They say between, I think it's 96 and 99. Yo, what is, the fuck is this? It takes just as long to get from 96 There's to 99. Listen, it takes just as long to get from 96 to 99 as it does from 1 to 96. Okay, so what happens if I kill an imp? Uh, not sure. They just die. And they drop ash. Uh, I attacked it and it looked like it did a... Uh... Like a weird noise, and then he just kind of like disappeared. Went red for a second, and then oh yeah, if you don't kill him immediately, they'll disappear. Yeah, it was a one. It was a one hit kill. Like I tapped him, and he just died. He should have turned into like a pile of ash. I think. I don't know. I already ran away. I don't care. Well, you asked. Shut the fuck up. I'm gonna kill all the cows around you, so you can never kill anything again. <laughs> the way I throw multiple darts and knives at them at the same time is just very disrespectful. Enact revenge upon your foes, causing any attacks you receive to increase your maximum hit by 10%, stacking up to 100% for 20 seconds. 
Whatever the fuck that means. It, it means every if means if I get hit ten times within a span of twenty seconds, all of my attacks will do double damage. You stupid fuck. Oh. Hey, so you know, remember how I said there was a, a backhand, right? Yeah. There's also a forceful backhand. <laughs> Listen, backhand, basic ability. Smack your target back of your hand, stunning them for 1.2 seconds and dealing 100% weapon damage, right? Yeah. Forceful backhand. A thresh threshold ability. Smack your target with the back of your hand, stunning them for 3.6 seconds and dealing 200% weapon damage. <laughs> <laughs> Smack the shit out of him. <laughs> yeah, I hear, I hear, I'm doing a powered up backhand. I'm I hear like, slapping the shit out of cows. <laughs> I'm just like, like twisting my arm around and I'm just, oh, wham! <laughs> Giving it all you got right in the fucking cow's face. <laughs> There's some people out there that would be like, that's fucked up, man. I love cows. The girl I was talking to is a big cow lover. She'd probably be like, yo, what the fuck? Was she really? Yeah. Is that a thing? Her favorite animal was a cow. I was like, why? How could anyone's favorite animal be a cow? Do you love steak? No. I don't know, man. I didn't question it. I didn't, I didn't want to question it. I would have questioned hey, it. Hey, I can also kick them. So not only am I backhanding them with a, a super strong hand... I'm gonna kick the shit out of him. <laughs> You're fucking beating the shit out of cows. <laughs> Your bare fucking hands. <laughs> Back slapping him. Backhanding him. Whatever the fuck it's called. Back slap. Slapping them in the back. I'm starving. I have to make some food sooner. I'm gonna die. Mm, shit's weak. I can't stop killing all the cows. I just can't stop. They all want to die. So I'm helping them out. I'm sure they can't wait to just die. Yeah, I think I gotta go get, make something to eat. Um, I'm starving. I haven't eaten today. But I'm way ahead of you. I would suggest you just training for a little while. I'm not going to do that. <laughs> well. I find no entertainment in this game solo. I only play it because you're here. You would if you uh, were a higher level. and You could fight things. Other than cows. Well, the issue with this game is it's just one of those grind to make yourself better games. There's no, like, real goal to it. Just make yourself well, better. I mean, you could do quests. There's plenty of quests. But there's no, like, main storyline to it. It's just random quests that you run around and do. Yeah, but any game that has a main storyline doesn't allow you to just be as free as this. Oh, there's scrolls. You cannot... It's still not nearly as free as this game. No game is as free as this one. Because most games look better. This game was originally a browser-based game. That's... I think that's pretty impressive. Die. Whoa. Mm -hmm. One of Stephen Hawking's most famous theories about black holes just suffered a huge blow. Oh, so. One of Stephen Hawking's most famous theories about dark matter, that is, that this is mysterious and invisible substance, that this mysterious and, and invisible substance is made up of primordial black holes. Okay, recently suffered a huge blow. Okay, I don't even know what the fuck any of this means. So basically he's saying that dark matter is made up of 
smaller black holes, primordial. Is that what that means? Recently suffered a huge blow. That conclusion from a massive telescope that captured an image of an entire galaxy in one shot. Wow, that's awesome. Dark matter cannot be physically looked at. It'll, it'll because it does not absorb, reflect, or emit light. And cannot be detected by observing electromagnetic ra radiation. Only way we know it exists is because of the effect it has on objects that we can directly observe. Yo, did you watch that video I posted on my Facebook about um, how small we are? How long ago did you post it? A few days ago, I think. I don't Most know. Not. It's pretty fucking nuts. Let me go find it. I'll tag you in it. I'm already on your page looking. Uh... Before you posted that whole atheist virgin god uh jesus thing yeah i don't know i'm looking it's no i think it was before that time. oh it has to be because there's nothing else yeah it was on april 14th at 7 33 okay, I'm, looking then. I'm still on 17 you put you did so much shit april 17th what the <laughs> i've been scrolling it says uh I said, check this sh shit out. Do yourself a favor. Humble yourself. You've never seen a single episode of Game of Thrones? No. You're missing out. <laughs> you really are. It's really fucking good. The first, like, first season, the beginning of the first season was kind of...